Welcome back, everyone. Hello, hello. So, we're going to be continuing our journey through the Boulder Dome, Boulder, Colorado. Fun times. So, if you remember previously, we uh, found a weird cat, and we need to find a cat expert to help us communicate with the cat or something like that, or to see what's wrong with it. Additionally, we also have an invitation from the NCR to go talk to them. The Brotherhood wants us to go explore the Boulder Dome area and uh, see if we can get the scientists to help them by giving them a cure for this, like, plague thing that's been messing with them. So that's kind of what's been going on. We're, we're currently doing three things right now. Let's go ahead and swap on over to that, shall we? I did move a little bit since last time. You're all aware. Because we didn't have to randomly walk around a little bit in the beginning, you know. You know how it be. So previously, we were like right around here. You know, we were near uh, the rest stop area. I, I went to the Brotherhood thing because I'm following this quest. Uh, the last resort, which is to meet up with Caspian. Captain Despot, part of the NCR, right? So, I'm going to be doing that. And it points you up to here. But then there's this area. Did not even see before. Like, I had no idea it was here. And it is the NCR, or not NCR, the Brotherhood Caves, apparently. And so, you come in here, the Brotherhood Steel Paladin stuff. And I was wondering why they seemed like so few people in that little bunker, but there's also an armory back here, and this is as much as I've really explored. There's also this guy here, apparently. You saying a thing, Edison? Nope. Okay. Oh, looky there. Missile launchers, power armor, pulse mines. Wesley? Ah, it's you. I've been waiting to speak with you. Elder Guile has told me all about you. And I've read Dr. Fabler's report. You're very talented. Fabler's report? Yes, Fabler is a crafty man. He claims to have been following your progress in the Mojave. I wanted to speak with you about a delicate matter. A young initiate, Jessica Robbins, was found killed in the bathroom a few nights ago. I'm supposed to be on leave at the moment due to stress. I've taken a suspect, Edson Blake, into custody but I've not felt capable to run a proper investigation yet. I could use an impartial eye on this. What do you say? Are you able to handle this investigation for me? Elementary, my dear Watson. Huh? Who's Watson? Is that a suspect? Well, it looks like you know what you're doing, so I'll leave you to it, sir. All right, doing an investigation then. Don't get too close. You're talking to a killer. Now you want to talk? What's the point in debating it? They all think I'm guilty. I hear them behind me. A guy's quiet, likes to keep to himself, and the imaginations run wild. I'm no monster, not that you'd believe me. I don't know if you're telling the truth or not, time will tell. That's fair enough. I'm glad you have an open mind about all of this. So many are quick to judge without knowing all the facts. So where were you the night of the attack? I was meditating in my room, then sleeping as most were. I was unaware that anything had happened until morning. I thought my heart would stop. It enraged me to think that someone could hurt something so pure and innocent. That person is still out there while I'm stuck in this cage. Who do you think the real killer is? Crawley. Paladin Crawley. He was always jealous of me. Hated me. Jessica, his girlfriend, had a soft spot for me. He couldn't stand it. He suspected we were together. He is a paranoid man. Many nights I overheard them arguing, but I never touched Jessica. We had a connection, that's true. But we were just... Friends. It wouldn't surprise me if he killed her himself in one of his jealous fits, using my combat knife to incriminate me. 
the man is a snake. How's it going, Shadow? Well, I'm gonna be going to investigate a little bit. Is this Crawley? No, the other guy. Anything here? Wait, hold on. Let me save before I do this and crouch down. Right here. here. A little more. A little more. There we go. Alright, what do we got back here? Whole lot of nothing. Why would they, like, toggle collision? Right. There's absolutely no reason for this to exist. Cool. Why was the damn door locked? That is the most, like, unsatisfying thing to, like, ever exist. Why would they do that? Hello. Look, okay. you have another quest, right? Monster blood for the monster murderer of this lady. So we're gonna have to go back that way. But before we do, explore the rest of this uh, Brotherhood cavern. So here we got some, you know, target ranges, which uh, <laughs> I don't mind if I do since this is all free. Excuse me, buddy. I'm gonna. Uh... Oh, you're Paladin Crawley. I'm gonna go ahead and take these microfusion things. Can I talk to you, Carl? Hey there. Big guy put you in charge of the investigation, right? Damn, I guess he fast. wanted an impartial eye in these matters, huh? Just do a good job. You need to find the real killer. For Jessica. She deserves that much, at least. She deserves more than she got. What kind of a man could do this? Poor sweet Jessica. She was such an angel. I can't imagine someone harming a hair on her head. Are for your loss. Yeah, me too. Thank you, all the same, though. Let's see. She doesn't have any enemies and it would hurt her. No, nothing like that. She was a sweet girl. Well-liked. You want my opinion? This was a crime of passion. Two words. Edison Blake. He's your man. You think Edison's the killer? Yes. As a matter of fact, I do. He's the only person that comes to mind. He was always leeching after her. But Jessica would have none of it. I heard that Jessica liked Blake's attention. That's not fucking true. She fucking hated that bastard. Don't push me, asshole. I'll fucking kill you where you stand. You could kill Jessica? No. I didn't mean that. I would never have hurt her. Not really. I hit her a few times, but never any serious damage. You gotta believe me. Hmm. But first he says Good. that he doesn't know why anyone would harm a hair on her head. And then he's like, okay, yeah, but I hit her a couple of times. Hmm. Okay, buddy. What else we got down this way? This is just a cave-in. Yep. This is just a way out of the area. Yep. Swamp. Oh, there's a swamp now? Okay. Oh, we're not going that way quite yet. We need to solve this murder. This is a bench. Nope, okay. Back out of the Boulder Mountain. I guess we're just going across here to the uh, labs. Okay. So. Down here. I suppose I can. Oh, you don't have anything for me then? Uh, Talk to the Elder. Have you news from the Boulder? Nope, I have not completed a mission. Okay. He doesn't have anything to say either. So, we'll go to the barracks. So, okay. So now it makes sense. I can't understand it. A murder by I one of the elder? Poor Jessica. Poor Crawley. He worshipped that girl. They certainly had their arguments, sure. But he really loved her. I can't believe an animal like that has been sleeping among us. I always knew there was something wrong about that guy. We jokingly nicknamed him the monster. Imagine that. Looks like he certainly lived up to his name. I think we should take him outside and shoot him. Nope, no new weapons yet, Shadow. Let's see, how can you be sure that he's the killer? She was killed with Blake's combat knife. It was found at the scene. I saw the way he looked at her. He was jealous of Crawley and what they had. He must have thought, if he can't have her, then no one can. That's evidence and a motive. 
The guy's guilty as sin. Raleigh and Jessica fight a lot? I don't know. I suppose they did. Now that I think of it. And Crawley likes to keep his women in line. You can't fault him for that. It would get heated. Probably ever violent to Jessica. Only when she got out of line, he would put her in her place. Mm. Not out of spite, you must know. Just to teach her a lesson. You don't think... No, of course not. Crawley could never have done that to her. I don't like where these questions are going. Let's oh, just talk like about truth, something though. else. We're reading out of the murder. I had a couple of drinks in the mess hall. Nothing unusual. And then I went to bed, like most nights. The other men will vouch for me, except Crawley. Now that I think of it, he did get up real late, probably around midnight. Figured he went for one of his late walks. That isn't a crime, right? Hmm. Oh. Owen. All right. This is what the locked door was. Go ahead and close it back up so we can investigate. The oh, nice. I have a recon helmet right now, right? Do this one needs a little bit of repair, so I'll go ahead and take that. Anything else around here? I guess that's just one armor. Oh, there's more recon armor there, huh? Okay. Let's see. Anything that could be the potential for a crime? Papers to interact with. We got some blood here. Evidence gathered. You investigated the crime scene and gathered blood samples. Take the blood samples to scribe Ellington. Okay. Why is there just bath water in here? All right. Real quick. I'm going to repair my armor. Here we go. Still does the same amount of defense, though. How worthless. Okay. Labs. Oops. Wait. Hello again. Do you Can you analyze this blood for me? I see. Sentinel Grant has hung the investigation upon your shoulders, hmm? Now let me see. Hmm. That's odd. There are actually two blood samples here. Oh. That would suggest the killer was wounded during the attack. Rather than taking blood samples from everyone in the building, go and speak to Penny. Dr. Anderson, that is. There was a full medical checkup the day after the attack. Find out if anyone had recent wounds. That'll narrow it down. Thank you. Hey, Penny. What seems to be the trouble? Uh, any wounds been treated since the attack? Before I ask that, you know Jessica well? I did, yes. I can't even think about it. Ugh, it's too much to even think about. I just have to move on and keep working. It's too hor- Sometimes getting your thoughts out in the open brings clarity. Yes, maybe you're right. Uh, I shouldn't keep everything bottled up inside. I was concerned about her relationship with Crawley. The constant arguments. She was such a kind person. So gentle. It upset me to hear him shouting at her. I heard him on more than one occasion. I confronted Jessica. She kept telling me it was her own fault and that she was a lousy person sometimes and Crawley only wanted to help her. Ugh, it was so sad to hear. She really believed she was worthless and it crushed me. More than a few times I found bruises during her medical exams. Ugh, she always had an excuse. But I knew the truth. I knew he was hitting her. I just never thought he would go that far. I still don't believe it, I suppose. Did he kill her? I honestly do not know. But it's scary to think that a killer is among us. I hope you get to the bottom of it soon. So did you find any wounds since the attack? Well, everyone had their scheduled full checkups the day after the attack. And only two soldiers had minor wounds, Crawley and Roach. Roach had a minor cut across his hand, and Crawley had a deep wound on his forearm that he'd recently treated himself was a terrible dressing. Anything else I can help you with? I believe that would be all. I'll be... So... A deep wound on his forearm is... probably some sort of defensive mark. You know, he raises his arm to 
defend against a blow from uh, Jessica as he's trying to kill her. Or maybe Jessica had enough of his shit and tried to kill him. And uh, he just kind of ended up like that. All right, let me get some of your blood, sir. Once again, you speak to... Give me your hand and he takes some of your blood. Why do you need that? I mean, of course. That's fine. Thank you. Now for Crawley. He's looking more and more like the murderer. Crawley. What now? I'm... Let me show me your blood. Why do you need that? No, stop wasting time with me and find the real killer. It's Blake. Give me your hand, sir. I'm just gonna forcefully take it. Ow! Didn't have to be so rough. I would have given it to you. For now. What a... Optional collect blood sample from Edison Play Clipper. Both of those, right? They're not. Why is it still Hello. the optional thing here? Once again, you speak. No, oh, okay. I guess because it's optional, it didn't leave or something. Whatever. Anyway, let's go back to Eddington. Give him the blood samples. Most powerful weapon I have is still probably that Gauss Rifle Compact. Okay, this place is a huge circle, and he likes to be down on this side. Hey, Weddington. Oh, wait. One of the barracks. Why am I going to the barracks? Is he in here for some reason? Weddington? Here? Yep, he's here. I suppose I can. Hold up. Who's this guy? Roach. It's such a shame about Jessica. She was a sweet girl in it. Ah. Uh, give me your blood. All right, then. Here it is. Take wow, he gave that up real easily, didn't he? Um, I'm not trying to get another weapon. I suppose I can spare a moment. Finish gathering blood samples. Ah, uh, yes, of course. Let me have a look, then. Hmm. Yes, that's a definite match. It looks like your killer is Edison Black, after all. Well Black. done. You should go and report your findings to Sentinel Grant at once. Really? Hmm. Hmm. That is surprising. Hmm. He said he had a cut on his hand. Hmm. Why did I even need to get Roach's blood? Talk to Edison one more time. Once again, you speak. No, I cannot. Hmm. I mean, he just had a, a cut on his hand, right? I can't ask him how he got the cut. Because maybe, like, Crowley cut him in the sleep or something and whatever. Thanks again for the assist. Let's see. Can't ask. I guess, can I trade with you? The Brotherhood doesn't normally trade without. But those with skill. Nice. Okay. Do I have that I can get rid of? Anything? I guess I'll just. I'll keep the C4, actually. Let's see. Ooh, the Machete Gladius. Plasma rifles, power charges, a... What the hell is this? 28, or, yeah, 28 damage. Huh? Do I have a 9mm? Do not. You know what? I will take this. Thank you, sir. But I'm not going to replace my environmental armor quite yet. It is medium armor, though, so maybe uh, I can repair it with that. What do you got for helmets, sir? Just the recon armor helmet, okay. Got miscellaneous. Go back to weapons to prepare what I have. Okay, so we got the VRB extended mags and the VRB scope. 
I don't have a plasma caster or a laser rifle or a grenade. A mercenary grenade launcher. Grab that baby. Hell yeah. And I will take all the ammunition you have, as always. So I guess I have found the uh, identity of the killer. Really? Let's see. It's you. No, it's 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 Edison Blake. I mean, there's blood evidence of it. Well, that certainly makes it easy for me, as he's already in the cell. So you're sure he's the killer? Yes, it's better to... I don't know. I'm having second thoughts, because, I mean, it's his knife. He could have cut his blood on his own knife, right? Or cut himself on his own knife. Can I not talk to them again? Once again, you speak to... Hmm. Can I talk to Crawley again and be like, Hey, dude, how do you get that wound on your arm? You again. The great... What's up, bro? Yeah, I don't know. I feel like there's not a, a good concrete solution. Like, sure, we have blood evidence for Edison, but it could just be circumstantial because of the knife. So. Hello again. Yeah, you know what it's Edison. Well, that's sir. Yep, shout out to Dr. That's good news, my friend. Thank you for everything you've done here. The right man will pay for his crime. <laughs> yep. <clears throat> Level up. Excellent. Um, what should I increase? I wish I didn't have to increase my points right away. That's one thing I never like. Repair is max. These things don't really matter. really need maybe I should get medicine up at least to 60 that'll give me uh, more healing with stim packs and then I'll increase my lock picking there last four points I'll put it into energy weapons hell yeah let's go okay next any new ones down here reader spray and pray your attacks do much less damage to companions that doesn't matter I don't have any companions Eye for an eye for each crippled limb you have, you do more damage. I don't plan on getting stuff injured. Maybe I should just. Hmm. Center of mass. My person. Fortune. I can get here and now and just get another 100 points. So I was thinking. Maybe I get intense training just to get my strength up another notch. Let's do that. That way I can have guns out while running and stuff like that. Let me let me quick save real quick. And go into here. Items, weapons. I got that new uh, weapon here. Go ahead and mod that. Got a rifle barrel mod for that. Did I get any other mods? I don't think I did. Yeah. All right. Anyway. Uh. Hmm. We'll try this baby out next time we get into combat. Ooh, it looks nice and a little compact. Okay. Hey. Anything to say for yourself, Edison? So, you have returned. Was he all from her home? The blood sample. Of course. I should have been more careful. Getting involved with Jessica, I mean. Crawley is a jealous man. By the end, huh? Think what you like. You think you're clever, don't you? In time, you'll be put to the test. You'll see. That feels like a thread, you know? What's that supposed to mean? Oh, nothing. Nothing at all. Yeah, I, I feel like he did it now that he did that. Now that he said all that. I talk to Crawley now and 
You know what I'm saying? again. The great. He does the same thing. All right. Anyway, moving on to the next quest. We go to last resort. Heading out this way. Journey around the great unknown. For some reason, the Brotherhood Bunker leads us out to a swamp. And we had to go through there to get over to here because the lines did not connect otherwise. So. Also, hold on a second. Couldn't I? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's nice. Um, display. I guess that's just Fallout 4 that has the, uh, the HUD and Pip-Boy layout or color changer stuff. Man, there's still more Brotherhood down here. Jeez. Like that. I didn't kill those things. At least in my ammunition. You want experience, though. Crap. Oh, no. Got him. Wait, is this thing not automatic? I thought it said automatic underneath. Oh, it's just a compact pistol. Oh, I thought it was like a, an SMG kind of thing. Where am I going now? I don't know if there was any entrances up there. A dead paladin, huh? Well, I'll just take all of this. Thank you, sir. You can leave your armor because I can't even use it. Wait, is there a path up there? Am I just blind? I'm probably just blind. You be like this. Yeah, I'm just blind. Cool. Let's go. All right. Going next. Here. Was this just like a huge tunnel network that leads us to the eastern part of Boulder? Deathfall Cave. That sounds horrible. If I look at the map now. We're still here. Okay. Hmm. Oh, 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 okay, okay. Oh, I messed up. Oh, boy. Uh, I'll go collision so I can get back up. I was trying to take a look down because I was like, I was going to be like, oh, that really does seem like a death fall. And then I actually, <laughs> I actually almost fell in. Well, oh. hmm. Happens. Maybe it's called death fall because of the falling rocks. Cause a lot of rubble around here. Oh, Jesus. Cry money. Bad cat. Going up here. Around this little cliff. Okay. What a place. Mm, this bridge does not feel safe. This gun's not bad. It does decent damage, good fire rate. About as quick as I can fire it. I wish it didn't have a scope on it, though. Oh, jeez, I need to heal. Uh, eight? All right. Yeah. Didn't realize I had taken so much damage there. It even hurt me. Rust cave. Man, I'm just going through cave after cave, huh? You think since it's one big cave, I would be... Oh, this spot, okay. Huh. This is odd. 
All the glowing mushrooms, I suppose. I saw another one moving over there. Kill the light. So I can get a stealth modifier on one of them. Next one. There it is. Fuck. At least it stun locks them a little bit. That's nice. Did not get the uh, the stealth on it. Maybe I should level my stealth up a bit. You guys are kind of fucking annoying. Ah, uh, yes. Mutilated body parts. Love to see it. I smell something. Oh, gods, he's jumping. That's right, get on the ground again. From inside, or in smell flesh. come from like here inside the uh, because I'm walking on not like that at all. This area, hey, guys are rude. All right. Do XMB11? For me. Got a shotgun or something. Do I have a shotgun? I don't think I do. Cigarettes, a bunch of random nonsense. Great. Okay. Well, and door to Rust Cave. Another door to the Rust Cave. Save the fire. Save the fire. Okay. Yep. <clears throat> that leads here. Okay. Or at least to XMB twelve as well. Oh God. Here a little bit. Is there anything actually here? I think it wants me to go back out to the rust caves, but let's investigate this area first, shall we? Door's inaccessible. What about this door. Why is a key, huh? Okay, so it looks like there's nothing here right now. Let me just quick sweep, make sure there's no keys lying around on top of the barrels. Didn't see any bodies, so that wouldn't be the case. You see a guy up here, though. So... Oh my god, he's right next to me! <clears throat> okay, moving on. Shuffle bag. Oh, a lot of loot, huh? A Watts laser pistol. How much damage does it do? 12? No. Nah. No, thank you. You can... You can... Or magnum rounds, though. Huh. Any bodies down there, though? Well, matter. Hmm. 
I want to go back, explore a little more. When I was in the other area, I just kind of went straight in. To another door. There was a lot more I could have looked around at. Maybe there's a key here, that one area that I couldn't get into. Oh, case box of ammunition. Did it charge pack. Not that I'm going to reload ammunition. Well, you know. The door I came through. Accessible. What about down this hall? Anything here? Rates. Dead end with a clipping texture. All right, well, that states my curiosity. We can go ahead and just go back the way we came. Hmm. Well, I need a key for here. Maybe I'll get it later on, and that'll be like a, a quicker path back to this area, maybe? I don't like about those cannibals that sometimes they can blend in with the background. Considered it. Well, nothing we can do here, it looks like. We'll just continue on our path. Hmm. I wonder if I'll find a key for that place later. Is there like a fast travel mark there at all, or? Doesn't look like it. Okay. Well, good news, I'm over on the east side now. Hmm. Incoming message. You have received an urgent message on your good boy from Sentinel Grant. I need a urgent message. In a situation here, come at once. I'm in need of your services once more. Which one's Grant? God. No Grant. No Grant. We did quests here. Turn to Sentinel Grant. Okay, so Grant is the one who gave me that one quest. Yep, radiation has expected. Where does this lead me? What's the map here? The brain center? Oh. Okay. Want to get a map marker? Cover the brain center. Requires a key and requires a key. Can't do anything here, but at least I have it so I can fast travel when I do have the information for that. What about this little tunnel here? Normal gate. Mutated cat. Okay. Up that path pretty quick like. Okay, it's coming back now. Too easy. Lock and load. All right. We got uh, this. Okay. Move the map again. So I'm heading towards the older military research center. And there's also Henry's scrapyard a ways. God, it's like a bunch of like meteors fell from the sky around here and caused a bunch of nuclear craters in the ground or something. Oh, what's this? Nothing. Okay. Can't use that. Yet. Maybe we'll come into play later. That's a big crater. Uh, seemed like it was another... Uh, I needed... Is it pointing me down there? No way. Fuck! I know I saw a damn cat roaming around. I just. Eh. 
Please die. Oh my god. Aim. My aim. Okay. Kind of panicked there and hit the wrong button. So I switched off the gun. That's okay. Go back out. Wait, it's pointing me towards that crater, it seems like. I go in these. Industrial shed and an industrial shed, okay. Anything in here? Yep, mantises. God damn it, I wish I had a flamethrower. Bang, bang. Okay. Well, they're dead. Anything good in here? Bunch of parts and tools and stuff, it seems. Dead people. A lot of uh, dead people, it seems. Okay. Oh, hey. Wastelander. Bottle caps and a knife, huh? But maybe I'd find a key to one of the places that I've not been yet. Check this shit out. Anything in here? Really, huh? Got nine millimeter rounds, though. Desk. Empty ammunition boxes. Five millimeter right there. Plus, but I'll take it. God. Hard cabinet. Damn, okay, so it's pretty close to the right. Here? A little less? A little more. A little less. Yep, a little less. Okay. I need the laser rifle. Can I interact with this assault bot? Nope. This kind of stuff. Okay. Can't have an assault bot, friend. That's important. Purified water. Open crate. More ammunition. Nice. Ammo box, what do you got in you? Micro fusion cells, I'll take it. Nothing else in here. Okay, out we go. So, seems like it's pointing me down here then. Enter military compound. Really? The entrance is in this place? Is that a dead kid over there? Oof. What am I doing? Light on, please. Something hiding around here. Okay. This reminds me of uh, Brotherhood bunkers. You know? Warning note. Impact. Don't know why he's dead if he had a Stimpak on him. Maybe he's starved. I guess Stimpaks don't help with starvation, right? All right, miscellaneous. Warning note. Bring about this place, Jill. It's infested. Weird pale ants everywhere. They have these nest ball fangs that emit kind of thick, ascetic gas. Stuff is vicious, eats right through you. It can tear you to pieces in seconds. Skin, clothing, armor, doesn't matter. Solves it all. I think that they got some kind of poison as well. One of the buggers nibbed me, and I don't feel too good. I'll wait for you. I don't know if I can hold back. Hold on until you get back. Rich. That's just a rat roach. Do turn about. Am I not supposed to be meeting the NCR? Between, like, them giving me the, like... Hey, go to the NCR compound and 
like me getting here? Did they get overran by just a bunch of rats or something? A foot locker. Definitely some sort of military checkpoint at least. Okay. Albino worker ant. Put it down from up here. Is there any more from yep, I see one there. Zoom in further here. Crouch. Oh, yeah. Give me that sneak bonus, baby. The one. Got it. There, all right. I love using vats to just kind of like scope out where people are at. Things, I guess, in this particular moment because they're ants, not people. Uh, that gas does not look healthy. Oh, we gotta try going. Uh. Yep. Oh, okay. Yep. Glad I saved right before I went in, huh? <clears throat> well, I guess the environmental suit does not even protect me against that, so that's good. I guess it is an, an acidic, corrosive kind of mixture. But we cannot go into the white clouds. Understood. Under. That was definitely not going to be helpful. What oh, ants do we need? Go up this way instead. Hunting rifle. Anything this desk? Item rounds. Awesome. Another uh, pointless footlocker. The lock. If I get it, I get it. Nice. Okay. What am I even looking for here? Hmm. I don't see any buttons on the wall or anything like that that could help me out. And there doesn't seem to be anything else down here that I can. Oh. No, I was just up there, right? This just leads up to here, and there's no way else to get up, right? Am I even on? I don't see any other way to get up further. Unless it wants me to, like, go over here? I'm on top of this stuff? I don't think I can jump up there, though. Yes, I can. Was that really the way it wanted me to go? Oh, I guess there's an area down there, huh? Fires key. Wait, terminal? Let's engage lock. Access denied. Level 1 clearance required. Key. Can I open this one? One required. Oops. Not mean to fire that bullet. I wish the Pip Boy light kind of shined out forward more instead of, uh, you know, like around me and behind. Call it. Totally missed this door. I don't know if you guys can see that very well. Let me see if I can increase the brightness at all. I think the brightness was already all the way up. Yeah, it was all the way up. Well. Oh, stay away from me. Oh, that's a soldier ant. Oh, gods. Reload while I have a chance, because that's going to take some bullets to kill. Maybe the soldier can't come across this uh, hallway. Oh, boys. Nice. Okay. Hit him in the head. Hit uh, there. Him there. Come on, here we go. 
Do it. Nice. Crouched right, yep. Excellent. I thought I saw one kind of glitching through the uh, ceiling there, and I was kind of concerned that it would come down and mess me up in a moment, but... Bean. Am I hitting the wall? Yes, I am. so much. I gotta have the extended mag on this bad boy. Condition's getting pretty low, though. Yeah, I'm starting to have jams and stuff, it looks like. One pass card. <gasps> oh, right, I forgot. I was like, I'll just walk through this mist. Ha ha. Wait. That doesn't even give you like a chance to get out of it. You just get shit on. Well, have I really, did I really not save this entire way for killing these? Okay, well, what guns do I have? Just try out the grenade launcher. I think I hurt myself. What? What? Hold up. That button. Huh? 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 How did I get up here? Weird. Where's that lock? No to ammunition, you know what I'm saying? Have that broken. Can I? Nope. So maybe I could destroy that stuff, but where does this lead? Or that's where I need to go, but I feel like I'm not supposed to get this way. I'm doing that. Yeah. I'm just gonna jump back down and that again. Please? Please? I'll just glide through the floor. Okay, back killing ants again. Alright, so don't, uh... I'm injuring myself. Yes, I know how healing works. This is the first time I may have gotten healed on this save, but it's not the first time I've gotten healed ever. Alright. Oh, what the fuck? Where'd you come from, you little bastard? Eh. Let's go. I think I'm getting poisoned or something. This machine gun's not bad on them. Okay, much faster than the pistol. That's right, get messed up. Okay. 
believe that's all the ants, right? Yeah, that's all the ants. Let's do a save here real quick. So I don't accidentally go into the white smoke and kill myself again. Okay, level one passcode got. Now I can run down here. Run around here. Here, back here. I still hear bug. I don't like it. Okay. Now that I have a level one passcode, I can get up here again. I can actually open these terminals. Something. How did I get up there the first time? Please, legs, I need you to jump. Okay. Here, I can just kind of. Eh, there we go. All right. Easy. Lemon squeezy. Locked with the terminal here. Cage lock. All right. This is some sort of locker room for some reason. Cooling unit. Okay. I've been looking, not me to pick up the cup, but whatever. It's in my inventory now. It is now canon that I have a cup in my. On combat. Desk. Assuming I'm looking for a key to get into that gate. That would be my guess. Average gun cap. Okay. This one's open, that's nice. In shape, so it doesn't matter. Okay, I'll take the hollow points. Anything else in here? Got a future weapons weekly. I'll take that. Okay, let's check this other one. Engage the lock. Okay, this looks fine. There's no ants in here. It's a good sign. On the desks. Guess we just got this safe, which has a utility gate key. Okay. That's what we needed. Now we can actually properly get through here. I wonder how we're actually supposed to get up here. Was, was jumping the way we were supposed to do it, or were we supposed to jump across there, maybe? That would make more sense than me uh, doing it the weird way, but I wasn't sure I could clear that jump, you know? Okay, so we got all that. We can now go to the military compound in the Warrens. Which is, uh... Dead end? Question mark? Or is this just... Man, I don't even want to do that. Nah, man. I'm just gonna fire some bullets through there. It's gonna be so gross. I don't want to go through this. Like, if I did not, like, try to go through this, I would have been like, oh, I, I guess this is just a dead end. That's what it looks like, right? God, I was expecting some sort of, like, effect of, like, cobwebs being on my screen. Stuff like that. Oh, man. Gross. The locker. Surgical mask, huh? Nothing else here. Continue on. Really low on ammunition. I do not think I can go in there. Close this door behind me. Reading glasses, microfusion cells, doesn't care about anything else. Energy cells, knife. Nice. 
Programmer's Digest. Not that I really need that, but... Scientist outfit. Ooh. Okay. There's nothing else in here. I think that was the, uh... Crap. Proc for, uh... Yep, the super alien thingy. What the hell did I just say to myself? I'm out of that. Uh, let's try the battle rifle on these boys. Oh my god, I love this gun so much. Uh, the little ping from the M1 Garand is just a... Uh... Oh! Oh! Such a good sound. So I'm gonna go in here. I'm probably gonna die. Yep. Might as well just die and eat the... Lost, so I don't have to use stim packs to heal myself. Even if it's a little cloudy, I should not go in a place. Got it. I don't know. Had another line. Okay, moving on. A Brahmin. I, I thought it was alive for a second because it was moving, and I was like, oh. Oh. They're like. Anything back here? Wastelander with some bottle caps, huh? Okay, well, I'm gonna get out of here, because this is gross. Wait. Activate con ventilation control box one. Does that mean I can go back this way now? It does. Also means that these little shits are here. Okay, enough of the slow death animation, please. Oh my god. Seriously? That's right. Okay. Pause it here? Anything of values in here. Not me to pick up that clipboard. God damn it. On the bottle cap, though. No, it seems to. Ooh, a new Coca Cola. Somehow that's still fresh. And not tainted by the toxins. Or is it inaccessible? Yeah, I don't think I can go through there. I'm going to have to go back this way. Close the door, close the door! Oh, I can't close the door. Oh no! Okay, you little shits. Listen here. Got him! Got the bug stomper one perk. Oh yeah. More damage against bugs. Running low on ammunition for this gun, but that's okay. Ring goop does not seem very nice. Ventilation control box two. Okay. I feel like I'm not even hitting those while I'm hitting the button. To toggle them on, but it's okay. Looks like the clouds have cleared. Is it really taking four shots to kill one? I'm, I'm sure I'm missing or something. When they're like rearing up like that. I feel like I'm definitely missing. Open this door. Clear tool cabinet. Wonder glue. Couple of energy cells. I'll take those. I have too many energy cells, you know? Oh my god. One sec. Yeet! 
<laughs> How do I fire it? How do I destroy it? How do I set it off? Oh, that's the queen. Yeah, that's why there were so many of them in there. Does the C4 tell me how to use it? No. I threw one, but I don't know. It did not blow up or something. Okay. I think we got most of them. There's the ant queen. She doesn't have anything on her. Okay. Hey, uh... Watch the C4 blow up like now and just take me with it or something. <laughs> Yo, though, I thought I threw one in here. Maybe it did blow up and hurt some of them? I, I don't know. I threw it like right here. Maybe somewhere ahead of me if it's still around. I just wanted to get the hell out of there. Okay. Well, I know I can't go in there. Uh. Okay. Hidden area, of course. What other guns do I have here? That one. This one. All right, let's use this one for right now. Blank projector room. Bathroom, right? Yeah, bathroom. Oh, first aid. A couple stim packs would be nice. There's skin for me. Copy pins. Nothing in the toilets, shame. The men's room. A briefcase with a shot glass, of course. Gotta, gotta have a shot glass in your briefcase, you know. What a, what a shitty, like, stall door. Some medex, sir, wow. No. Okay. Moving on. Our door, huh? Ah, uh, it would be something back there, but better. Uh, let's see, force it. Give it empty. Got. It. That lock. Force that lock. Nice. Got it. All right. What else we got here? We got a laser rifle and some microfusions. Words. Armor piercing, huh? Ten millimeter some machine gun, laser pistols, energy cells, nine millimeter. We got some combat armor just hanging from the wall. I guess they were testing them. Casings. I'm looking for a way to shut off the gas back here, right? Be a, a switch or anything, though. Maybe it's in here. I didn't explore this room very well. Okay. Yep, of course it's in this room that it does not make sense to be in. Because this is like a boardroom area, right? Here we go. Wasn't anything back here, right? No. Okay. Four more shots. Let's go. That's don't fail me now. Got him. All right. Only got two bullets left, unfortunately. We got some more millimeter electronic charge. Whatever EC stands for. Right. Ah, no, my bobby pins. I don't have many of those, Dan. Oh, 
ammunition. Okay, I got some armor piercing. Enough for a uh, killer two. Quick save here. Rail race bikes. Hmm. I don't really need those yet, though. We're getting closer to the actual military place, right? The compound maintenance. Can't go this way. Can't go through the gate. I do not like how foggy it is down here. Kind of disconcerting. Am I supposed to just jump down? What? No. That is not what I'm supposed to do, right? I don't know if I can progress, though. Right? There's no, like, other hidden passages, right? I didn't miss anything since it was so foggy and cloudy in here. Oh, this sucks. Okay, well, if that's the case, I'm going to uh, pull out a better gun. I hit the wrong button. Go with... One. Can't hit anything from down there, so let's just jump down. Still nothing. No enemies. Good, good. Sarsaparilla. Who throws away full bottles of sunset sarsaparillas? Okay. Well, leaving out this way. I blew it away. Excellent. One straggler. Let it all end. I really cannot aim this gun. I do not know what's going on with it. Like it, it shoots way too high or something. Eight here. I don't think that's back this way though. No, nope, okay. We're just gonna you want with them. NCR encampment, finally. Oh, there's a shortcut in Stop and out. Stop right Shit. there and don't move a muscle. Ooh. This facility is the property of the NCR. You have no business here. Turn around now and wait. You're the one we've been waiting for. The lab rat from Nevada. We knew you'd come here. The captain's been waiting to speak with you. I suggest you follow me. And don't fuck around. You mess with me, I'll pump so much lead in your face, your mama's gonna use your head for an iron. Okay, lead the way. Okay, then. I'm taking you to see Captain Despot. He's the finest man I've ever served, so you better speak to him with respect, Vagrant. Let's Vagrant. go. You invited me here. Get off your high horse, you little bitch. Maybe do a little bit of a hustle, though, huh? They even got on this tunnel. Barrels, okay. By the way, I cleared all your, your ant problems in the other areas. So uh, you can move into that facility now if you clear it out. <clears throat> By the way, just throw it out there. Thought I'd help you. All this Yahoo? No, I think I can go on ahead. I hear you're from the Mojave. That's good. I need someone with minimal ties to Boulder. Someone dispassionate enough to do what needs to be done. My spies tell me the Brotherhood brought you here. No doubt they've tainted you with their propaganda, told you merely half-truths. Resorting to lethal force was a last resort to contain the Seltzum Syndrome. There is no cure. The Brotherhood's dreams are merely that. Dreams. They do have a cure. It worked on me. That is only a half-truth. Traces of the virus will still lie dormant in your blood. They could reactivate at any time or spread and infect others. For years, the How do you NCR know? worked for a cure, but in the end, we realized the only cure is death. 
It's a cold truth, but a truth nonetheless. My orders are clear to eliminate all potential carriers of the disease. To leave it unchecked is too great a risk for mankind. This must be done. Sometimes in life, one must choose a lesser of two evils. The cost to the country as a whole would be too great if I did not complete my mission. Mm. Yeah. Who are you to judge me, courier? My actions are not my own. They are the actions of the people. I have the cure, and it is a bloody one, I admit. Life is not always black and white. Sometimes difficult choices must be made. The lives of a few are not worth the lives of all. Listen to reason. Will you help us or not? If you cannot listen to reason, then get out of my way. I don't have time to justify my actions to an ignorant fool. So here's the thing. He says that there's no cure, right? And if there's no cure, then, like, that means I'm still infected, right? Which means, by his logic, I'm still a carrier. And so, if I were to help them, they're just going to kill me in the end anyway. At least that's what my interpretation is. Probably not the way the game and the quests are going to go for them. Probably gonna like somehow be like, okay, you can go free now, even though you're still a carrier of the disease. But uh, yeah. So the information I have right now, their methodology, doesn't really work out in my favor. So I'm gonna go ahead and tell them no. Very well then. That's you're right. Just watch your back out there. In an enemy today. I don't know why that was not. Uh. You know, voice. Okay. Evening. The ammunition box requires a key? Wow, okay. Hello. Any other of you yahoos around here wanna talk to me? I'm not into the small talk. Move along. I got for the duffel bag. They can't open the rest of their stuff. I haven't voiced either, huh? Yeah, no, I'm good. I'm, I'm out. Peace. Okay, so, go my quests. Okay, so basically the quest is either help him or don't. And those are the only ways to do that. So, um, we're going to check back with Monster Blood Part 2. And uh, I'm going to go ahead and do the world map and fast travel to... I cannot fast travel from this location. Are you guys fucking hey. kidding with me here? Okay, well, there's a ladder up here. If this is the manhole... Oh, you son of a bitch. I'm a little upset by that. They could have just told me, hey, use this hatch here. Or, like, had someone waiting outside the hatch for me. Because they knew I was coming, right? But instead, they were like, hey, bud, we're gonna just have you uh, go through this area. Dangerous, death-filled area and clear it out for us before talking to them. I should have charged them an extermination fee. Damn. Don't have the strength to spawn this weapon. Well, that is unfortunate. Anyway, we're going to go to this junkyard. Then we're going to head back to the Brotherhood compound. All right. There's little patches of grass. Be coming up here in just one moment. One we'll find in this junkyard. Henry Scrapyard. Looks like Henry over there. Water. You Henry? Hello, hello. What's this? A uh, customer, is it? Don't get many of those, you know. Those bombs scared away my customers. A war is terrible for business. Unless you're selling guns and bombs, you know. Well, I sell a bit of everything, whatever I can find. So tell me, what brings you here? Um, you've been here since before the Great War? Huh, yes, I have, I have. Not personally, my great-grandfather has, or was. He's dead. We have the same name, Henry, so that counts. 
You're not the same person, though. You have the same name. Ha ha! A comedian, is it? I did some stand-up in my time, before the war. I know, I read it in my journal. I read all about what I used to do. Okay, you're obviously insane. I'm gonna repair my stuff, though. I'm gonna repair past 75%. Repair my minigun and this stuff for me. Thank you, kind sir. I'm done. Um, what do you have for sale? Bows? I have a miscellaneous garbage that I can get rid of. Okay. I think that's all I had. Weapons today, I'll get rid of that. New cola. Keep those repair kits. I only have one Rataway? I hope he has some, because so I'd like to get uh, taken care of. And these the C4, I don't even know how to use them. I'm just going to get rid of them. I never have enough ammunition for the Goss minigun. Also, the mercenary's grenade rifle was garbage. It did not do what I expected it to do, so we'll get rid of that. All right, Henry, what do you have for me? I'll recharge my stim packs. Thank you. Um, let's see. Miscellaneous is just a bunch of garbage. Doesn't have any ammunition, of course. Oh, it goes. All right. Um, we can about the boat outside. That's my junk ship. I call it the Mighty Junker. I take it up the river to search for things that I can sell. I need things to sell. It'll need some gasoline to run. Mickey used to take care of that. I hope he's okay. Uh, anything interesting going on around here? I saw some soldiers heading into the caves nearby. Once I saw a soldier shoot a ghoul dead. Not a feral ghoul, neither. He said he was infected. I fell into one of those smoking pits once. It jogged a lot of old memories from before the war. Can't believe I'd forgotten all that stuff. I heard the government did tests on chimpanzees in this area. I don't know what a chimpanzee is, but it sounds scary. Okay, well, I'm gonna go and uh, loot your house. Oh, you have nothing in here. Damn, bro, you live like this? You sleep on this, like, trash heap? I thought Henry disappeared for a second, and I was like, did I just talk to a fucking ghost? Does he sleep on outside? I guess there's a little bit of cover from, like, the elements and stuff. But... Hey, dude, you do you. I'm going to look at this boat real quick. Maybe I'll steal it. I don't know. We'll figure that out when we come to it. I can't do anything with it. I think I needed fuel, but... Like, about Mickey? There's nothing here that I can interact with. What the f huh? Hold on real quick. Um, let's do, hey Mickey, glad I found a message. I know, look here, I have to out a rattle. I'll tell you where to find it. Near that old military bunker where we found the white ants, where the smoke pits are, on the way, there's a path leading to a bay, and you'll find a junkyard, so where I'm at now. I think you know the guy. You'll have to swim through the cave tunnel. There, you can find your truck. Sorry to leave you, pal. Dude, okay. So this is what we're talking about. So that cave tunnel, or is there a cave tunnel somewhere here? Also, what is that? It's like a just a giant graphical glitch, it looks like. Okay, so if I... Go up around here real quick. I want to get to like the sweet spot where I can like see clearly under the water, you know, really dark water. Okay, so I don't think there's any like thing down here. Oxygen, oxygen, oxygen. <sighs> My guy cannot hold his breath at all. Okay, so there's clearly nothing here. However, I'm gonna go down the tunnel. We'll go down this tunnel, see where it ends us up at. And I can't just walk it, I gotta swim it. 
Travel through tunnel. Okay, where am I at now? Uh, world map. I'm here. Okay. There's a car. Yo. Hold up. Okay. I don't think I can go any further down that way. This is a truck. Yeah, honey. Oh, yeah. You don't have the ignition. Are you? What do you mean? Where's the ignition key? It didn't mention anything in the article, did it? That didn't matter. Gas. Had to leave the truck. Tell you how to find it. Right, you'll have to swim there. And you'll find your truck. Sorry to leave, old pal. In your city, if you want to catch up. Oh, where do I get the key? What? Oh, this is rigged. Also, I tapped on it, and then it, like, went this far. It, it took that long to pull up. Okay, so can I go through this way? No, I cannot. Oh, my God. Hold on. Uh, cancel that. Damn, I was hoping I could, like, cheat in an ignition key. Um... Idle, I don't know, help, ignition? Key? Oh my god, there's so many. Okay, um. Oh, that's so far. Uh, help. Truck. Is that a thing? No. Well, uh, can I fast travel from here, though? I can't go to the brain center either. And so, would that take me from here to, to here? Or is this not Outer Nevada? Hold on. Is there a place called Outer Nevada? Look like it. Hmm. All right, well, let's just go to the Boulder Junkyard, I guess. Now that we have Henry's place locked down, if we do somewhere get an ignition key, uh, we can turn there. It's disappointing. Found the truck, but I can find a key. And it wasn't with the other guy. I his body that was, because if he had a key on him, I would have picked it up, because I'm not an idiot. I wouldn't just leave a key behind. Hmm. All right, so let's find out what this uh, distress message was about. Or what? Did the uh, one guy escape? Yeah, they escaped or died. Oh. I really appreciate your help on this case. I have something I think you'll appreciate. It's a rare handgun, salvaged, repaired, and fully restored. The Brotherhood doesn't make a habit of sharing tech, even a relic like this, so don't get used to it. I trust you'll put it to good use. France Revolver. Is it good or is it bad? 65 damage, huh? Oh my god, it's, it's really good, actually. Okay, anyway, you needed help. I somebody? have some bad news, my friend. Blake has escaped and killed Crawley on his way out. I need you to track him down and kill him if necessary. Mm. Edson has a prototype pacemaker keeping him alive, made by Dr. Field, who was asked to speak with you. I suggest you go see him now. Excellent. What can I do for you, friend? Okay, well... Evening. That was uh 
So he killed Crawley and left. But why? Either he did that because Crawley was the one who killed him and he wanted to get revenge, or killed the girl and he wanted to get revenge, or he's just a psychopath and killed Crawley because he wanted to kill Crawley for hurting Jessica. Kaka, kaka, kaka. I don't know. This glowing thing. Oh, it's a little lamp thing. Field? I'll be short and get straight to the point. In his time of need, I implanted Edison with an artificial heart. Not a pacemaker, an artificial heart. A source of great pride for me, you'd expect. But I'm a humble man. All my actions are solely based on furthering science. Remarkable, though. The advances one can make, if his intentions pure and intellect razor sharp. Anyway, back to the point. Edison's artificial heart can be tracked. Its unique electrical impulses can be picked up, even at a great distance. Also remarkable, don't you agree? Mm, Your pip boy there could even do it. In fact, I've produced a software update just for you. Just let me take a look. There. That should be all set up now. It'll lead you right to him. Excellent. No need to thank me. Totally unnecessary waste of speech, I'd say. So much of daily conversation is redundant. Now, I must be getting back to work. Okay, thanks, Field. Bye. Two. I was thinking it would be like a radio thing where I'd have to like follow it around like that, but apparently not. Okay. Go out here. And... Uh, ah, fuck. Okay. Probably a dead body somewhere. No? Damn. What loot is that? Man, I hope it doesn't make me go through all this stuff again. Although maybe that's what the X, M, um, whatever area that was locked before. Maybe it'll be open now. Who knows? Do a quick save though. Hmm. So did Edison escape past this guard? Well, interesting. Maybe Edison's got friends in high place. Let him escape. Anyway. So we're going back through this tunnel again. Yay. Man, if I would have known, I would have just like waited a little bit. So that I wouldn't have to go back through this again and backtrack. At least everything's dead, I don't have to worry about that. I guess that's a bonus, right? Uh, the little check mark there. I wish my AP regenerated faster. How's it going, Red Sun? Yeah. It's kind of the, the inspiration for my model is a tech priest. And infuse it with like flag and stuff like that. So, Nurgle's tech priest is indeed what I would probably look like. Although, I'm sure I'd be more grotesque if I was a, a Nurgle tech priest. Be some more disgusting disfigurement and stuff. Gotta be hiding in here, right? I guess. Hey. Okay. Are we going? Going back to the XMB1, okay. Wait, I want you to go back outside? That doesn't seem right. I think it wants me to go over this way. 
Yeah, okay, why don't we go here? SMB12. Means that the door that we couldn't open before should now be unlocked. Yep. Yeah, Red, this is a, uh, a mod called uh, Beyond Boulder Dome. It takes place in Boulder, Colorado. As you can see, the map's a little bit different than the normal Las Vegas. Oh. Why would a fool like you follow me? You came here in a coffin and you'll be leaving in one. But this time, there'll be no waking up, you hear me? I had my revenge on that bitch Jessica. And Crawley, that pathetic excuse for a man. He didn't deserve to live. That coward was a mercy killing. To ease him of the suffering of being himself. Now I'll do you the same favor. Go ahead and struggle, you miserable little creature. Well, I thought, yeah, I don't think it's new. No, uh, I'm not sure how long ago it came out. I was just looking stuff up. Oh. I was just looking for like total conversion mods and I found this one and I was like, oh, I'll, I'll play through it. Ah, crap, freaking mutants. This gun sucks. I don't like it. Okay. You know what? Okay. Easy peasy. New color. Uh, New California is not finished yet. I thought it was. I plan on playing that one next. After I finished this, it looked decent. I was like, oh, this is gonna be cool. God, these things are fast. I see. Does the uh the like the main story at least have like a uh an ending to it? It doesn't just like say, thanks for playing up until this point. So I've played a couple of Okay, cool, because I I've played a couple of all out three mods that were just like you've reached the end of the current playable area and whatnot. It's just like okay, fine. Oh. Oh my god, aim, please! Yeah. Okay. Well, luckily, I don't really play Fallout games for... Oh my god, I just fell off a cliff. Shoot you all in midair, I don't care. Oh, did I just find a way to cheese these guys? Oh yeah. Guess they can't attack down below. Nice. I actually like the frontier, it's pretty cool. For the most part, I mean. Again, I don't really play Fallout games for the story. I just kind of, uh, I, I like the exploration factor and stuff. Uh, yeah. Oh, snow is great. Yeah. Like when I was, uh, I really liked like, the opening scene and stuff of the frontier. But then, yeah, it got kind of like weird at the end after, you know, various things went down and how like the story unfolded, it felt like. There's a key. Do I have a key? I don't have a key to get in there. Well, I'm just going to try to kill him through the window. Yeah, 
Yeah, I think in my Fallout, in my New Frontier playthrough, I, I ended up wearing Legion armor, I think? I can only shoot him in the legs, but that's fine. Do it. Triple him. Okay, well, I can't get in there yet. Okay, yep, not gonna make that jump. Um, let me see. There's gotta be a key somewhere. Hold up. Oh, cap mine schematic. Don't really care about that, but take it for now. Yeah, once they started doing like the, the weird acid trips on the space station, that was kind of like strange. Um, very weird. I was like, what the heck is going on? Especially when they were in that like fiery room with all the, uh, where you had like that boss fight thing that was just kind of weird. I think I ended up like cheating at that point because I was tired of dealing with that thing. There's really not a way to get in there. Hold on. Maybe I can like jump on top of it and get on the other side. Okay, let's, let's go over here and get us up. Come on, jump. Damn. Okay, how about this? <laughs> no more locked door now. Hey, he's got a lot of health. I don't like this. Bring the back away slowly and close the door. Oh, the gun I was using, Shadow Kong, was this uh, VBR compact pistol. I think it's a gun that's modded for this particular thing. Yeah, I try to... Oh, God! Okay, this gun's much better. Here we go. Here we go. Easy peasy. Yeah, playing without Psycho is kind of rough, but I like to do, like non-drug playthroughs sometimes, you know? Okay. Dead. Huh. I'll go ahead and take that gun. Okay. So was there a way I could have got in here like normally? Or was I supposed to just kill him through these little windows? Was I supposed to come through like this back entrance somehow? There's not even a way to go here. Like when it comes to uh, like Fallout 4, I would use the Jet and Psycho like all the time. It was just great to like go into that slow motion stuff. But like in uh, earlier Fallouts, Jet doesn't really do anything useful, I feel. It just refreshes your action points or something, right? If I remember correctly. It's been so long since I've used Jet and stuff in like normal modes. Oh yeah, he's a pussy. Okay. Let's return back to Grant. Oop, this. Actually, couldn't I just fall down from here? That would be a shortcut, right? See if I can jump correctly. Let me get up on here first. Then I can keep jump off there and jump down here. Then jump here. Great, okay. Now, all down here. Go. More cuts. Jim, you can't fast travel when you're in caves like this. True. True. Fallout 1 and 2 were good. I loved playing those. I really like the isometric, like, gameplay style. 
of Fallout 1 and 2. It's always a, like really cool to play those kind of games. I'm just right here, right? Yeah. Boom. Nice. Oh my god, going back to the frontier was that vertebrate flight sequence where you had to shoot down vertebrates and stuff as like maddeningly like difficult for you as it was for me, Red Sun. It was like impossible for me, I felt. It took so many tries for me to finish that. Yeah, like near the end of the game. Where you're like flying in a vertebrate after you leave the space station. We're near the uh, the end of the game, right? In the frontier. So. You put an end to Blake, and the case is finally over. Here's a bonus for seeing it through to the end. You're in my good books, soldier. Nice. All right. I got 200 caps for that. Did I get experience? Uh. Up. Hmm? Okay, my, wep my weapon's in... Peril glitched out for a second. I was like, what the heck happened to all my guns? I was like, I'm going to sell you back your, your I'll revolver. I'll assist you in any way. I, I don't want this thing. Garbage. Got any more ammunition for me, though? Two. Thank you for your ammo. I'll be going now. The flying carrier was neat, but yeah. It was pretty cringe. Okay, what's my next quest? It's just to find the cat expert and then to access Boulder Dome, which I gotta go through here again, right? I got this way? Okay. Then down this way. And through this cave does yeah I mean I will admit some of their front uh, some of the the frontiers uh, cutscenes were cool I, I enjoyed some of them like some were just a little bit way too weird for me. I just was not into it. But like near the beginning when you had like the uh like the introductory area and stuff like that, that was pretty cool. But some of it was pretty cringe, yeah. Where am I going? Okay, so there should be like a cave here, I guess. This is all just a system of caves and mountains and peaks and, uh, okay. Jump down here? Ow. There goes my health. I forget, does health come back when you wait? If I just wait like six hours, will it come back? Or do I have to actually sleep in a bed or use a stim pack? I gotta actually sleep in a bed or use a stim pack. Great. Oh, okay. It was just a... One of those, like, press E to, to travel. Fun's a little bit concerned there for a second. Okay. Little lakeside cabin. And there's a bed in here I can use. Can't even enter it, so no, there's not. 
that a ghoul? It is a ghoul. Okay. Where am I at now? I am here at this little area. So I'm near the inner boulder, cave tunnel, and Nova Industries area. Gotcha. Radio transmission. You've received a transmission from an unknown source on your pit boy sent by the radio. Let's see. Unknown transmission. The transmission contains the coordinate data of the following message. Still alive out there, my name is Kate. I was captured by Dr. Fabler and brought with you to the same truck in Colorado. So sorry I left you there, asleep in your cryo chamber. Some creepy looking tin men were coming with some serious firepower. I had to get out of there. Looks like I got myself into some serious trouble this time. I'm being held in the dead factory. Use the coordinate data to track me on your pip boy. Careful though, there are some creepy ghouls here. Okay. Well, we have to rescue Kate. So let's track the dead factory. For those of you just joining us, Kate was this uh, woman that we met up in the beginning. We wanted escorted to this Dr. Fabler's lab to do weapons research. And I'm out of stim packs. Oh, God. Anyway, we did a. We were lured in with weapons research and promises of caps if we did so. And so. When we got there, we found out that we were just going to be test subjects for curing a virus. And she was one of the people who also got captured during that. I think all these doors are just going to be worthless, right? Oh, no, apparently this one I can actually get into. Yeah, well, let's explore a bit. This hallway door looks like it will provide access to the other side of the building, but it's jammed and cannot be opened. Perhaps if you had a fire axe or a sledgehammer, you could break it down. Okay. I don't have the tools. Well, let's find a fire axe or a sledgehammer. Oh man, I, I hate that effect so much. There's gotta be a mod to like get rid of that effect. When you like come down off of drugs or something, right? Gotta be a sledgehammer in here somewhere, right? Oh, look, a fire axe. Convenient! Heck yeah. Let's see. Can this really be happening? Oh, uh, crap. I clicked to her. Let's see. <clears throat> oh my god, yeah. Head crippleation is the worst. So... Jane, I'm sorry I wasn't around to reply to your emails and calls yesterday. I was in a meeting with Robco Bean Counters. That Robco Bean Counters? That went uh, went long in the night, and I came in... Goddamn. I'm not able to read this for some reason. I came in early this morning because there is something I have to tell you. I don't care if it goes through the company server anymore. You're too important to me to worry about that right now. Oh my god, I can't believe this, but honey, war is coming. Me and another Robronco guy, a Robco guy, hit it off pretty well. He told me the Chinese are going to start bombing soon, real soon. Definitely going to be bolder. Uh, when it happens, I'd like to be with you, what I love, my wife, you, Jane. If you hear or feel anything, you can come up to my office so we can go to the next life together. Jane, I'd be honored to hold you in my arms at the end come. I love you. Three, can this really be happening? Oh my god, what? The bombs are coming for sure to Boulder? John, isn't there any way to stop them? Can't we at least uh, do anything about it? Is there somewhere we can go to be safe? Someone has to do something about this. I just got happy again. Oh, John, I need to get my wits first. Oh god. Okay. Three, is this really happening? Forgive me for earlier, I'm still shaking, but at least I think more clearly. Yes, I'd love nothing more than to be in your arms at the end, too. Maybe we'll be together after, after life, together that way. I'd much prefer being with you than talk about being with Michael and hearing him talking about the project and how there is no way to save it. I'm sure that would be the case. When it happens, I will come upstairs with you. John, I'd like to spend the very last seconds kissing you. I won't be scared knowing you're with me holding me tonight. 
I love you so much. So, so much, John. You hear that? What was that? Oh god, I'm coming upstairs now! I need a big favor, smiley face. Need a big smile. Jane, I hate to bother you, and I know it's awfully short notice, but I need a big favor. Yet again, I had something pretty nice planned, and it fell through last moment. I made reservations weeks ago to take Grace to the Highland for dinner and our date night, and she just informed me that she had to work extra late tonight and couldn't go. You can't make just make reservations at the Highland and then cancel at the last second, you know. They truly frown upon it. If you're free, Jane, would you like to accompany me? It can be a working dinner, of course, and I'd really like for those reservations to not be lost in my reputation at the best restaurant in town soil. We could map out the best strategy to employ so this new software changeover might go a little more smoothly. Besides, I'd be happy if you have your company for the evening. Are you free? Jane Smith, or John Smith. Free, John Smith. I'd love that, John. It would feel good to get out of the town for once, and I've always wanted to try the Highland. I really think our spouses are working for the same boss over there, lol. Michael is always staying late and pulling all-nighters at the last minute as well. I swear, if I didn't know any better, he was employed at the Dome. I swear he was having an affair. He never looks at me the same way anymore, and sometimes I feel as if I'm invisible or... Oh, never mind, my silly talk. Let's just go have a nice dinner. I'll bring along some files, and we can discuss some ideas. Hope you'll like it for this new software. Meet you there at 11, Jane Doe. I like how they uh, have John Smith and Jane Doe, and like their last names aren't the common spellings, so it's like, aha. That's funny. Anyway, lose something important? Oh my god, what is this? John, I think you left a few important folders over in the lunchroom. Run them up to your office if you wish in about 30 minutes, by the way. Can you believe we might get uh, bought out by Robco? First Repcon arrow, now us. We'll be buying everyone out of the sun. I hope we might finally have some software changes. Okay. Well, that's just you know, normal stuff. Personal files. Coffee tonight, coffee tonight. We're doing amazing. Um, are you sure what we're doing? Michael and I were first married, if that tells you anything. Blah, 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 blah. Okay. This is just their affair stuff going on. Nothing new after the bombs fell or anything like that. So let's just sign off. Okay. Are there two skeletons that are like... I guess it would be these two, maybe? Oh, yeah. It actually says John Smith and Jane Doe. So they ended up in uh, each other's arms dead on the ground right in front of his computer. Nice. Well, actually named the skeletons. But this guy over here, this poor guy over here. Nope, no name for him. Yeah, it seemed like they uh, they were having an affair, and potentially their spouses were having an affair with each other as well at their job. Lock on, all right. What do we got here? Just some computer equipment that's worthless. A reception area, I guess? Filing cabinet. Door, huh? Rest rooms. It's just rubble. Oh. A vault. Oh. Wait, there was an underground bunker here, and they didn't think, like, hey, maybe we'll go to, like, the underground bunker and try to survive down here. I guess this is only for the executives or something, huh? Well, there's nothing down here, is there? Just beds. Man, I really wish I wouldn't have wasted my, uh, my super stim pack. I could have just come down here and... You know. Slept. Anyway back through here. So this is inner boulder. 
locker, locker. Why is there no ghouls or anything in here? Just a kitchen. Doesn't seem to be anything of value in here other than food. We're back here. Okay, well. I guess I'll go out this side. Oh, speaking of ghouls. The sights on this gun do not work. They aim, uh, their, their sights are up a little bit high or something. I have to aim like, I guess the, I don't know. It's weird. Okay. Anyway, did I really need to use a fire axe? I guess to get past this semi trailer, maybe. Hmm. Look at the map real quick. I need to go to Nova Industries further this way. Okay, so I'm actually going the right way. Did I just have like a prompt to do something? I thought it looked like a prompt. I guess it was just the little yellow part of the gun there. Can I get in here? Oh, inaccessible. It goes. Okay. Sure, this door is not accessible either. Nope. back this way. Like it? Well, there is pieces of flesh here. Is that from the ghoul I killed? They really come all the way down here? All right. All right. Can I get past here? That's the question. And a gunfire. Man, I don't like hearing gunfire, but not seeing any, like, red markers or anything around. Kind of disconcerting. Oh. Well. What the hell? Oh. Who are these yahoos? Death squads. Oh, that's lovely. Bring it on! Alright, I need to use a super stim pack. Okay. <clears throat> Easy peasy. I don't know what they were firing at first, but uh I think that marksman combine. You guys got any armor on you? Got squat armor or my house. That better than mine? I think mine's pretty good, my my current armor, right? Damage threshold 17. Yeah, mine's better. What gas mask? Of four, huh? Oh, that's better. And a ghoul finger. Are they ghouls? I don't know why there's a ghoul finger, but I'll take it. Did I just get shot again? I did. I do not have these spare stim packs for combat right now. Maybe I should get the cannibal perk. Oh, I leveled up. Well, I guess let's get cannibal. Okay. What should I level up now? Repair is maxed. Hmm. The energy weapons higher. How about that? We'll get that to 70. There we go. And put one more point in sneak. Okay. <clears throat> this cannibal gives me health when I eat stuff, right? Yeah. I think we'll get Cannibal. Yeah, nothing else was good here, so. Hey, bud. Mind if I, uh, mind if I snack on you, or can I not? Can I not snack on you? There we go. <laughs> don't mind me, sir. Just eating you up. I barely healed anything, damn it. Little's better than nothing, though. Where was the third one at? Did he just blow into bits? Yep, I guess he just blowed into bits. So if I crouch down and uh, try to devour this piece of meat. You know, actually, there was just enough death troopers that I killed to replenish my health to full. Nice. Do they have any loot here? 
Get to an exhaust tower. The last one. Take his stuff. And devour him. Thank you for your sustenance. Also, it's weird that you lose karma for it, even though, like, it's not witnessed, you know? Okay. Equip the death gas mask, whatever it is. Okay, so... Cannot get in there yet, because there's no key. Meanwhile, I'm just getting irradiated like a motherfucker over here. ruins looks like it okay well i need to keep going this way and i can't get out of the crater from here so rude i'm gonna go back this way real quick right here a little bit hmm nothing there was another red marker over here, though. Ah, Feral Ghoul. And I blew his ass everywhere. Oh, yeah. Alright. Did see another ghoul when I killed him, though. Man, I need, like... Someone who will trade me more stim packs. Manhole here, can I use it? Inaccessible, okay. There. Or I need to find like a pharmacy? Go to Smithy's Bar. Okay, well, I don't see anyone here. I guess I'm just gonna take all these Nuka Colas and Sunset Sarsaparillas so I can heal later. <clears throat> I was really ill-stocked when I came to this location. I'll also take all the food and if I can get here. If it heals, it heals. Okay. Oh, damn. Okay. You notice all this stuff up here? Oh, am I overweight now? Damn. That's vodka. I don't need vodka. Let's see. Let's drop that and the re... Wait, I can equip both the recon armor helmet and the death squad gas mask? Okay. Let's see. The marshman carbine does 22 damage. My assault carbine does how much? 14 damage. Okay. So my assault carbine is pointless. I will go ahead and get rid of that in a moment. That one. Drop the fire axe. What else do I not need right now? Okay. Um, let's see. What does the light machine gun do? Because it is 15 pounds. 22, huh? And it uses the same ammunition. So I'm going to go ahead and just drop the light machine gun. I don't need that. Drop the extra marksman carbine. And I think good. Quick save real quick. I like how that landed. All right. Marksman carbine. I'm going to set you as uh, master key number five. You will be... Oh, I don't really care about setting you there because I need a... Uh... That key open for stim packs. Gosh, there we go. More sunset sarsaparilla and Nuka Cola. All right. Let's go to my aid panel here, quick. Bail and rads. It doesn't seem to increase my HP at all when I eat it. So never mind. I'll just drop these. 
effects old, huh? I thought, I thought water healed you, does it not? Mm hmm. Up all of that, thank you. Okay. Well, I guess we're going back outside. Drugs, hold up. Can I go in there? Can I go in there? Sounds like it might uh have some stim packs. Oh. Um drops, bubble gum, cat eye, doctor bag. Come on, it's gotta have some you know stim packs, right? I'll at least take some rat away though. That, that'll be fun. There we go, two stim packs. Hell yeah. Even got purified water. Rat away, Mentats, rat away. Buff out, Mentat. Dirty water. Okay. Another Sunset Sarsaparilla. Really? Just two stim packs in here? Man. Robbed. This. Oh, a super stim pack. Nice. Anything else up here? I guess there's just a Nuka Cola. Hey, free bobby pin. Hell yeah. Kind of run a little on those two. Alright, so... Let's quickly bind that to eight. So I have a couple of those on short key. Clicker is over there. That's a cleaners. Hmm. Where am I at now in the world map here? Moving away from Nova Industry. There's also cave tunnels over here. I keep getting more and more irradiated too. Maybe I'll take some of uh, the rat X and rat away real quick. Cleaners, laundry, and storage. Beauty supplies. Maybe they have stim packs? Maybe they have bobby pins too. I like how it says beauty supplies, but they have like a bunch of cigarettes in here. This glowing substance. Absinthe? Hmm. I like how it glows. Cool. Bitter drink. Well, nothing here. Older tunnels over here. Oh, car. It's open. Rocky Mountain Instrument Company. Eh. I go in that one. That one looks creepy. No. Okay. Manholes inaccessible. Ah, crap! Tastic. And into a bunch of tools. Has very good aim from here, but let's try it. Crap. Yep, I'm dying. God, they can hit me from so far away, and they're so accurate. I don't even want to deal with those guys. I just want to leave now. Close to the cave tunnels. I think it's right up there. Can I just hide? Maybe they'll like lose interest after a moment. Also, I already used up all my stim packs. I've got supers left. Well, in caution. They did not hesitate to like just open fire on me either. A little run out of ammunition, I don't know. It should be the only way up, I think, right? Right. Let me see if I can get a good sight on one, maybe. Ah, 
Got him. Oh yeah, baby. Okay, I don't need to see that. Come on, stick your head up again. There we go. Nice, all right, two of them down without much health lost, perfect. Okay, barrel down. One more down. Come on. Got him. Nice. All right, they're all dead. Excellent. Oh, boy. That was close. Hopefully there's no more down here. I can feast on the corpses to refresh me here. Oh, man, I missed. That sucks. Oh my god, he crouched right at the fire. Okay, okay, buddy. You wanna wanna play this game? I'm gonna move a little closer. Fuck. Twenty-five percent. Jesus Christ. This guy's strong. What the hell? Took like three shots to kill him. Okay, moving on. Devour, please. So I've got five bodies I can eat now. Take your ammunition and your ghoul finger. Thank you. I'm still in caution status. They're not like that. I don't even know what these ghoul fingers are for, but I want to take them. Me just gonna eat ya. I'm getting a good amount of five, five, six from this. This is really irradiated, huh? There's gotta be some other stragglers around. Don't like it. Yeah, they really liked to put in long animations that didn't make sense. Like the kill cams when you get like a critical and stuff, like it's just unnecessary. All right, my health is almost back to full now. Thanks for all those bodies. I wish you gave me a little more health. That'd be nice though. Or if one body filled me up, you know, that'd be really cool. Let's do a quick save here so I don't have to throw that nonsense later. That door's inaccessible, of course. And this door is as well. Cool. Any real reason to come down here? Well, I'm hidden now, at least. Yeah. See anyone here? Over there. Okay, well, I guess right now I'm safe. I think I heard some fire come from that way, so I gotta be careful when I go over there. But for now, I'm curious, are the tunnels this way or are they up that way? Probably up that way, if I had to guess. This is more of a path that way, and that was just a wall. Hello there, Mr. Ghoul. Can you, uh, shut up? Bang, bang. Good rifle. Caution falling rocks. Yeah, I understand that's a bit of a rock problem you got there. Can I eat the, uh, no, I cannot eat the 
ghouls. That's unfortunate. What's ghoul up here? Hmm. So is this not the tunnels then? Can I get on top of this? I can. Excellent. Oh, the tunnel's just right back there? Because I'm like right on top of it, right? Yeah. Cave tunnels have to be back there. Fortunate. Let's see if I can. I cannot go down this mountain. Okay. That did not seem like the fall was going to kill me. You want to throw that out there? Where did I last quick save? Right before here. Okay, so there was just one ghoul up there. It doesn't matter. So I've got to get through this building, I guess. Do I have any radix on me? I do. Oh. Although it did not help at all. Or maybe it did. I don't know. Where? What the hell? Jump! Oh my god. He's trying to jump on like a sloped surface. Jump first. There we go. Where? Okay. Okay. Apparently it's here. <clears throat> okay. Sorry. What is in the cave tunnels? Take a quick peek around. Get out my uh, gun here. Oh, yes, it's a cave and the tunnels. Hmm. Why is there reinforced concrete here? Deep metal? I guess it's from roads or something collapsing up above. Hmm. So far, nothing. In here. Where does this go? I wonder if this is the path that leads me up further northward. It appears to be. Yeah, so I think I continue through here to go to the main quest, which I do not want to do yet. So I'm going to turn my ass around and go back out and rescue Kate. Because maybe she's the cat expert I need. I don't even know what that cat's going to do when I rescue it. Ah, broken water pipe, huh? Okay. Back outside we go. Let's just steer clear of the... Can I eat this part? Nope, I cannot. Let's hope maybe if there were dim chunks, I could eat different parts of them. Apparently not. We'll quick save again. Okay, well. I know that area up there is not... What? Oh my god. Are you kidding me? Roaming death troops. Holy crap. They don't even, like, hesitate. They just, like, gun your ass down, too. Oh, does this not... Okay, whatever. I'll just drink them all, then, if it's not gonna... Use my health at all. They haven't come around the corner yet? Are they just camping that corner? They were not there when I went inside. That's rude. If I drink more, does the effect stack? I don't know. Doesn't seem like it's doing anything. What? What do you mean? What do you mean music? I don't know. Maybe it does. You know what? Here. Let me just assign this to key 8.
and I'll just occasionally toss one back. Okay, so we're nearing the area once more. Gotta get across this crater. I guess I can just go around there, maybe? Be able to do this. Oh, there we go. Okay, full health. Nice. I guess I'm gonna go there, but... Man, that does not seem very inviting. This is going to be a trap. Well, let's get captured again. We got a blinding flash and who's this Yahoo? Cool, huh? Excuse me, kind sir. Private Cilia, huh? Move Cilla? along, Wanderer. I don't know how you survived this far, but you won't much longer if you stay here. I'm not even authorized to talk to you. Yeah, you're doing it. Beach, who's gonna know if you talk to me? Did you weren't authorized, I mean, you're in cigar. You seem awfully bored here, you sure you wouldn't enjoy some company? Let's see, I'm gonna go with speech. I guess you're right about that. But if the sergeant decides to come up here and I'm talking to you, he will skin the leathered flesh from my bones. Look at our friend of mine named Kate. I think she's inside the building. No Kate here. Now go away and leave me alone. Heard on my radio. She said the NCR picked her up and is holding her against her will. I don't even know what the NCR is. Now for the last time, fuck off. You know, it wouldn't be hard to wire some C4 to the outside of this box. Hey, hey, now wait a minute. I'm not gonna die so Blyven can get his rocks off. If anyone's gonna die for her, it should be him. I will let you in, but you're gonna have to leave your weapons. The sergeant will want to speak with you. Just remember, we can kill you at any time. I mean, I can kill you all at any time, too. Uh... Damn, I guess I did. What? What? Hey, you. I missed. Billy Brussels? Who the fuck is that? Wait, did Billy Brussels just kill that guy I was talking to? Is that why he died? Bruh. Okay. Billy. I can rifle have an ass motherfucker. Give me your ghoul finger, you mother. Well. Like I ain't getting in now, huh? I feel like I could crawl under that, but okay. Anyway. Now we gotta find another way in. Map tells me it's... All the way down there. Oh my god. I feel like that ghoul in the trench coat just like shot that one guy and then decided he was gonna kill me for some reason. So now there's this door here that is apparently unlocked and I can get into now. Okay. Once we're inside, I'll need the sniper rifle. Oh my god, this is deep. Okay. Door to Reclamation. Investigate Nova Industries. Barrel Ghoul Boys here. Hey there, Reaver. Romer, I guess. Never mind. Okay. Go across here, I guess. Oh. 
Shut your mouth, ghoul. Aim. Door here, right? Yep. Okay. What's the next grate that's clogged up, it looks like? Can I go through here? I can. I can exit the subsystem there. But first... Hell yeah, more ammunition. Okay. Well, it gives me two options, but it wants me to go through this one, so I'll go through this one. Oh man, I love climbing through grimy tunnels. Are you hissing at me, huh? You can just hiss at me without getting shot in the face? Very rude. Okay. Really wish I had a combat shotgun or something. Locked up. Goes back to reclamation. So is that where the other door would have led? I feel like the pipe was kind of useless then. Can't get through there. Please move this area here. Oh, hello, gentlemen. Ah, uh, he healed a little bit. Ghouls. What we got here? Can I sleep on this? I can. Nice. So if I get injured, I can just sleep here. We're just dealing with the ghouls. It's not like we're dealing with those damn hella accurate death troopers. I'm really curious what those death troopers are. Obviously, they're ghouls of some sort, but. Like, what what action are they exactly? Hmm. Down here. Okay. Door to the abyss? Bruh. Oh no, not gunfire. That's never good. That means there could be those dang death troopers around. I got this gun silenced though. Look at that ghoul's getting shot. I got six bullets left, so we can't use this gun anymore. Use the combine. Yeah, yeah, the, the combat carbine, where the hell it is. A coffee mug and a briefcase. Fuck. Of course. All right. I can kill five more death troopers if I'm lucky. I'm gonna wait for him to stop. I don't want to waste a bullet. Just him? Yeah, just him right now. Goodbye to your head. 
He's got the same looking uniform as the guy who was in that booth. I guess the death troopers are the ones who took her away? Well, I can't get across here. That much is obvious. I'll have to walk around. Okay. So they were shooting these ghouls, huh? Oh, well, that was some sort of like potion on the ground there. A hunk of ghoul meat. Yes. Jet. They see me? They did. Are you kidding? It hit a rock? Fuck off. Damn it. Assholes. Yeah? Let's go. Come on. Bring it. Let's go. Let's do this. Actually, you know what? Crap. Aim at his arm! Make it so he can't hold a gun. Are you serious? Seriously? Isn't this gun, like, good? Did it lie to me? I said 25, right? Yeah, okay. Fine. I'm using this one then. They killed him. Of course they killed him. I can start shooting me first. Yeah, let's use this. And let's feast upon their flesh. I wasn't expecting the gun that they were using to uh, be so worthless, but apparently destroy the life out of me. Okay, well. Hmm? Well, there were sandbags back here. But I'll just devour some of them. I can get some health back. Ammunition box. Well, I don't think I'll run out of 556, five, but it's unfortunate that, uh,. Their guns are worthless. To me, anyway. Apparently, they can just destroy the hell out of me. Okay. Why did that animation feel longer? Right away, please. In. Mm. God. Really need more 50 cal. Measure. We'll just devour this guy. Nom nom nom. All right. We're just gonna keep this gun out then. Everyone else is gonna just be worthless. Well, at this point on, I'm gonna guess we're gonna encounter more death troopers since they were defending this place. Open sewer grate, open door to wasteland. Interesting. Okay. Where are we at now? We're getting closer. Okay, they're just barrel ghouls, thank god. I might be able to use my, uh... This rifle on them. Ah, 
nice. Okay, let's hit him a couple of times. And once we go. Do what I wanted to do. Wow, that was a lucky shot. Even the glowing one doesn't share his uh, love for death there. Yep, he's down. Right along. Back into the maintenance tunnels, huh? Okay, so four is the gun that I want to use. What the hell? Where did you come from? Okay, where did both of you come from, I guess? Have some easy headshots. I'm out of nowhere. Okay. Back in here. Not the radiation. Was one death troopers doing there? Through this, I cannot. Fine. Cockroaches. I really wish we're not close up on those guys. Really do not. All right. I go past the, for some reason, electrifying rubble. fighting on stairs. Alright. Alright, very linear. Let's go. Nova Industries. Finally, we're in Nova Industries. gunfire. Open this bad boy up here. We got a guy up there. A guy down there. Another guy up there. Oh my god. I forgot I can aim with their guns. Alright, well, I'm gonna take this guy out. Or I'm gonna completely fucking miss! Wow. All right, let's save. Probably gonna die. I wanna try and just get through here without engaging them then? Maybe I just gotta get to this gate. Okay, inner boulder. Nope, apparently not. Apparently I need to be in this area. Craptastic. I can't use bats from this range too. Yep. And they're looking towards me, man. Come on. What other guns do I have real quick? Not gonna be enough, not gonna be enough. This one. Maybe this one would work. Press some AP. Let's do a quick save.
Yep. That went about how I expected it to go. Lovely. Bats? Bats, please? Okay. Uh, center Maxim. Go. I'll miss. Lovely. Can you guys not? Can you guys just not shoot me in the face, please? Okay, he's down. Die, 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 die. He's down. One more. Let's go. Come on. Want some? I can't even fucking hit that guy. One more super stim pack, I guess. Let's go. Maybe I'll hit him better here. Okay, he's gone. <laughs> okay. Hands there, it is the battle rifle. Okay. I can't tell if I'm hitting them or not. I don't think I am. This is dealing no damage. I think they're deciding to just fuck off. You know what? I got a stealth boy, let's use it. Nope, they saw me. That's how this goes. Back, back here. I need to go up, apparently. Nope, this is just a dead end. Okay. Great. At least if I'm underneath them, they cannot hit me, right? Gonna... To get as close as possible, take them out. Higher though. You see nothing. I don't know how long the stealth boy lasts. I wasn't timing it, so. I guess when we're dead, we're dead. Unfortunately, there's no cover up here. Okay. Don't have cover either. Carefully. Carefully. Ready and go. Got him. Nice. Oh yeah. Now give me some of your flesh, sir. Thank you. And now your friend too. I can candle it. Ugh. And a dash equal. Okay. All these places are boarded up. Hmm. Anything up here? Nope, that's broken. Down here, I'll take I wonder if I get that uh, Devour Corpses 25, does that like increase the health that they give me or? Never really eaten enough corpses to know what it does. Oh, almost fell off. Goddamn. 
quick save so I don't do that again. Okay. NCR outpost, huh? I saw you coming a mile away. I pulled up a chair to enjoy your death. Pity you let me down. Though I have another use for you now. Come find me. No one will attack you inside the factory. But I can't control what happens outside these walls. No one will attack me? What the fuck is this then? Huh? Is that not attacking, sir? for my eyes to look at that. Ow. I used the darkness. And, uh, do to me. Oh, can't use that. Oh. Please hit. My aim with this gun not, like, work correctly. I don't understand. Sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't. Shut up. Just fighting ghouls, I might as well use this gun instead. It wants me to go to the reactor, huh? Take that. Over here. Get some. Eh. I don't want to hey. deal with fighting them right now. Although I'm probably going to piss them off and have to kill them anyway. This guy. Urgent I hope you, know you died when you walked through that door. Everyone in here is already dead. Looking for a friend of mine by the name of Kate. We have her. She's going to be our concubine as soon as we get the generator up and running. You must really love her to risk your life like this. Mm. What I got to do to get her out of here, huh? I admire a man who makes sacrifices for others. You took a big risk coming down here, but your sacrifice. Has just begun, my friend. Yeah. I have a task for you. I need those ghouls cleared out the other side of this building. We need to get our generator back up and running. Go talk to my engineer for the details. He'll give you the rundown. You show me you're willing to do this, and I'll give you your girlfriend. Hmm. Pretty sus. And now I'm radiation sick, of course. Where am I going? What am I doing? Hold up. Talk to the engineer. But uh, I guess he's down there. How do I get down? Staircase. This place sucks. Why am I taking so much radiation damage? I'm just looking for a staircase. Please. I really don't have the rat away for this. Isn't this fucking suit that I have on supposed to be, like, protecting me against? Yeah, I have 85 radiation resistance here. I'm still getting radiated. God damn. Possible way down, maybe? Oh, damn. yourselves. Well, that's a ghoul trooper. I don't like that. 
Can you not? Go. That's a reaver. Okay. Nuka Cola Quartz. Hell yeah. This is a marksman rifle, Shadow Kong. Can I go down already, please? Generator encryption data. Nope, that's not what I need for that. Okay. First supply cabinet. Guess I gotta talk to the engineer first or something. Why does the generator have encryption data? Bizarre. At least I'm not taking radiation damage now. A moment. Mind me, I'm just gonna eat you real quick. Oh yeah, there we go. I wonder if there was an easier way to get down here. Go engineer. I hope you know this is a suicide mission they're sending you on. Ever since he took his. He's been fond of forcing others to do it, too. Um, Sergeant said I need to talk to you before I go in there. Yeah, I need you to get some spare parts to fix the generator. You'll find them in the supply closet. If you have the know-how, feel free to get the generator back up and running. If you don't, then please. I joined up here. As a sapper of the NCR Special Forces. I volunteered to help fight the Cell Sam Syndrome because I lost a sister to it back in Cali. It also sounded a lot safer than being behind the front lines with the Legion. They never told me how gruesome this work would be. This process may have changed me into a ghoul, but I lost my humanity a lot. Okay. I volunteered to become a ghoul because I had already become a monster inside. Sure. Right, I'm gonna get going. All right, so now I got to go all the way around again and tap the supply closet. I think there's got to be a different way to get back up there, right? Yeah, supply closet, tap. Oh, well, the engineer told you there doesn't appear to be any parts that would help fix the generator. Have you noticed a promising looking Nova Industries emergency maintenance toolbox with set by step instructions inside uh, swapping and malfunctioning parts? The parts themselves are missing from the toolbox, but you note space next to it for another three or so similar boxes. With luck, those toolboxes will be parts in the area. Okay. What if I just like fix this though? Transfer full power to reactor. Okay, activate power generators. Despite the severe damage, your expertise allows you to repair the components without finding new parts. The power generator is now running properly. Okay. Activate power generator. Optional. Find a way to lock the terminal so they cannot ghoulify people against their will. Oh. Route power to the reactor so we can continue to ghoulize men. Okay. Lock system with password encryption. You did it! You got the power back on! But, for some reason, the power isn't coming through to the machines! Did you fuck something up? No. 
Okay, I'm gonna head down there and see for myself. If you fuck this up, I'm gonna turn you in. Hey, bud. You say, mate. Anyway, computer was locked before I got here, so they should be none the wiser. I just gotta figure out how I got back here, huh? Uh, I think I went this way. Then through here. Over to here, maybe? Yeah. Now I'm rad sick again. The last right away. God, I'm taking five points of radiation every fucking second there. What the hell? Can you come talk to me, sir? Please? Fucker. Fine, I'll just get radiation sickness on well, I'll be damned. I thought we were gonna have to go in there ourselves and clean it up. You saved me a lot of time and resources. I guess you want your woman back now. I don't know if you saw on your way down there, but she half cool now. Maybe you're into that. If you want her still, she's yours. You didn't happen to see what was wrong with the generator while you were down there, did you? Why would I say this? You did what? I knew I couldn't trust you. Let me guess, you have a moral issue with what we're doing here. Just insurance, in case you change your mind. Well, that's twice I've underestimated you, soldier. It's no wonder you survived out there. Give me the password, and I'll give you the girl. I see you have little trust in a man's word. I will forgive you since you don't know me well. I don't give out my trust easily either. Let's see. Some of your men said they were fortunate. I don't even know what I'm talking about with this. Um, I'll be on my way then. Bye. Loser. All right, let's get the hell out of here. Tired of taking radiation damage for no real reason. After the barracks. Fuckers better not shoot me, I'm on your asses. There you go. gotta get me out of here, man. They're gonna put me in that machine. Turn me into one of them. Hold tight. Oh, thank you. Thank you so much. I've seen so many of them die so far. They bring you in in a coffin. Well, they... Okay, anyway. Hello, everyone. Hello. Dennis. You're the one who's going to fix this thing so I can get out of this cell. I'm going so crazy in here. I just want to get it over with. I have seen plenty of death in my service with the NCR. I've even come close. If I die, oh. at least I will die doing my duty. I've seen... So get your ass down there and fix this. I can still hear the others screaming. Hello, Kate. I... I'm Kate. Don't you remember me? Yeah, I remember your cave. What the hell happened? I. It's complicated. I don't know how to explain. I. I need to get away. Yeah, I remember now. Well, it seems I've rescued you a second time. You're free to go. Please. Can I come? Let's see. Yeah, come on. I, my stuff is. Okay, I, I, I cannot continue to listen to her talk like that. Better stuff's in a small box. I mean, that one? one. Hmm. Something about Kate's cat? Cat's Kate? What is with her, like, arm and stuff? Okay, let us leave this place. How do they do this? Thank you. Hopefully she like stops talking weirdly after Hi a bit. There. Private fingers. Damn, how did you get such a nice avatar? While the rest of us look... What are you talking about? Oh, come on. You can't tell me you don't remember being carried off in a VR pod with the rest of us? 
Okay. Why aren't you armed? People tend to blow up if they pick me for co-op. So I sit and think up. I think he's insane. I, I'm, I'm, I'm good. I'm just going to leave now, sir. How do I get out of here? Do I got to go up there to get out of here? Oh my god, I think I do. God damn it. Okay, you know what? It's fine. I'm just going to toggle collision and go back up here real quick. I don't want to have to climb back up here. Yeah. Oh. Well, I see. It'll be like that, is it? Screw it. We're going back down there. All right. You got your girl. Now give me. Okay. Good. Now get out of here. I don't want to see either of you again. Plus, these death troopers have to deal with them better, so. I'll just go ahead and give them the wrong password. I don't know where Kate is, but we're going to leave. She should appear next to me. Yep. Okay. Hey, Kate, let's go. Hello. We've got company. And they're not here to deliver the mail. Rad roaches away. That's not the way to go. Uh, Alright, door right here. Door note industries. I can't believe we made it out alive. I don't know what to say. That's twice you've helped me now. Do you know anything about cats? I just acquired a new slave. Anyway. Yeah, I guess you're right. It's been a long time since I've met a good person. Cool. You know anything about cats? Are you okay? Can I ask her? Um. Personal question. You know anything about cats? Come on, come on. Let me ask it. You're from? I suppose. Grew up in Alaska, so abandoned a child. Bushes. As I saw the hunters killed. Sure. All imagination, tell me the truth. Okay, okay. You're sharper Ripper than most. Shans. Oh, that was a soldier in cigar. Done a lot of travel. I never okay. seen. How do you have enough open industries? I ran into a few ghouls just outside Boulder. They said they were headed to some kind of refuge for ghouls in the camp. The death squad found us. The ghouls just started running. So I. Not before seeing my new friends gunned down in front yep. that weird little man Bliven. Yep. Uh, Nell's graveyard? I should have known better. Fin yeah. So you can relate then. Well, she did the thing about cats, so I don't think she can do anything with them. But at least we're outside now, which means we can fast travel. So you know what? Maybe we uh, fast travel back to junkyard and we try anyway. Maybe she just doesn't say anything about knowing anything about cats. I don't know. See what happens. All right, come with me. You're gonna meet my new friend. Eight. All right, Kate, come on. Kate, this is the cat. If you had a better understanding of a species, maybe you could uh, And, lucky cat. Fine. Whatever. All right, well, Kate's not the one then. Must be another companion somewhere that knows about cats, I guess. So, let us travel. Actually, let's take a quest. A uh, better way. The cat expert. Is there still not a marker for this? Wait, there is. Cat expert. The boulder underground. Okay. Okay. I'll have to go to the same place for that one. So let's go and travel to the cave tunnels. All right, Kate, let's uh, go before a death quad shows up because I don't want to deal with them. Yeah. All right. Now that we're in the tunnels, I think that'll be a uh, decent place to end things for now, everyone. So let's do a save.
we went on a nice little journey today and uh you know got around and saw some stuff and things killed some death troopers got killed a couple times ourselves they're uh very very accurate with their gunfire but yeah so we have kate as a companion now we still need to find the person who knows about cats but our last line objective area is to just um you know find the boulder dome that'll be the last area we really explore on the map it looks like so yeah the next time we'll be doing that uh if you've missed anything or you missed the last couple of episodes or anything like that they're on my youtube channel you can find a link to that down below if you're watching on twitch if you're watching on youtube you can follow my twitch the link is also in the description there so check that stuff out anyway everyone thank you all for hanging out and i will see you all next time Bye for now.